Oh, hey, didn't even notice you there. So, uh, come and join me as I unbox the Mont Bermion. I don't know how to pronounce that. Bermion? 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 If I'm saying it wrong, let me know in the comments. Anyway, let's unbox this bad boy. Normally, I would think that's silly, but, man, they really took some time before I even unbox it. Nice, Mont Bermion logo here. It says, for passionate professional craftsmen and makers. See if that'll focus for you. On this side it says, waxed canvas tool apron. On this side, it's just an Amazon logo. And then this says, waxed canvas tool apron again. So, I mean, I'm just saying, super slick. They took, a, they took pride in getting this right. So before I break it apart, how cool is that? I'll read you. It says, Hephaestus, Hephaestus. I don't know if I'm saying that wrong or right, but Lord of the Forge, fire worker and metal shaper, carver and crafter, father of technology and invention, consort to the love goddess, broken one, Hephaestus. I don't know, open the way into your sacred workshop. Teach me the paths of hammer and measure. Guide my hand in both creation and repair, by anvil and spark, by metal and wood and blade. Hephaestus, I call on you. So, now you're getting serious. Let's see what it looks like. Pulls out. Got some silica gel. That's some desiccant. Do not eat. A little bit about this waxed canvas tool apron. Information, thanks for buying from us. We hope you enjoy your tool apron. As with all our products, we have carried out extensive research and design and development to ensure it's efficient and productive for its intended use. If you have any problems, yada yada, small favor. If you bought it through Amazon, leave a product review. Yeah, that would be nice and I'll see if I can. Now that's nice. Shouts to Mont Vermian. Hope I'm saying that right. This is this is truly nice, man. I was I'm super impressed. I'm glad I picked this one. My wife got me this for my birthday. Before I go any further, I want to check out. Is this just a little notepad? Yeah, this is pretty slick though. They got their own little notepad. That came in the pocket. Yes, this is pretty nice. I will have to uh, model this for you and give you a full tour of it when I can set the camera up on a different angle. But for now, check it out. Up at the top, you got pockets for some pencils, four of them, and another little pocket down here. Got a nice size pocket here and here. Then you got two pockets, big pockets here. And they can Velcro open or they can Velcro closed. You got a little pocket on this side, a little pocket on that side, and then on each side you've got hammer options and options for your tape measure. So super slick. And then you can also, if you don't want it to be so long, you can zip this bottom edge off. And it comes completely into a shorter apron. So I'll show you a little bit more here in a second. Actually, let's just do that now. Hey. Hey, how are you doing? Oh, yeah, you. Now what did we come down here for? That's right. To check out this apron. So, so, so. So, down to business. I have had a chance to kind of check this out. I haven't had a chance to work with it. I still got the tag. But so far, the uh, attention to detail is amazing. Um, I'm, I am impressed with it. Every little thing I kind of think about, like, would you do that this way? Would you do that that way? Little metal clasp here. And that's metal. I like it too, though, that it pulls tight where you want it. And it'll stay. It'll fit tight. Even I'm a really slim guy, really slim, like 32 inch waistline. 
I can get it to easily fit. It's got some, you know, it's got some hanging down the end here, but it's, it fits well. It feels good. But then also, if it got pulled, it's not going to rip it. it. It'll come loose. So that's kind of nice if you're, you get done and you need to, you know, breathe and get it off of you. So, you know, I'll tell you, one of the main things that made me notice this early on was that it did have pockets on the front. It has some pretty decent sized, hand sized pockets on the front, but they're not just wide open. They have pocket covers. They have, uh, you know, flaps, but it has Velcro right there. You can pop these suckers open really go to town if you need to. But I like it. I do a lot of woodworking, so I want to keep those closed. Um, I do like that it is kind of ambidextrous because I am right-handed, but sometimes I, I do things with my left hand. So, you know, one of my uh, old hammers. See how it feels? Doesn't add too much weight. I like the way the uh, shoulder straps work. They they look like they would, even with just a t-shirt on, they don't feel like they would dig into you for too bad for too long. Maybe make some pads if you were having to wear it all day. But I'm I'm really digging the idea that, uh, you know, you could keep a uh, tape on. And if you have to bring it on an awful lot, it's metal. It's not going to wear out nearly as fast as, you know, something canvas or something else. So, you know, between... Between the boxing and all of that, I think it's well worth the price of this. Uh, I'm I am really excited to get a chance to work with it. I don't know if I pointed out. I don't remember if I pointed out in the video that you can zip this off if you don't want it to be as long. I believe this will zip off like that. Sweet, and then you could have it stop right at about your knees. I'm just under six feet, five foot eleven. So it zipped off. It hits right at about my knees, the way I've got it now, and then it comes down to the middle of my shins when I've got the whole extension on there. So you know, this feels good. The things I liked about it, things I noticed that I think are cool. These uh, grommets, whatever these these loops. They're just big enough for this to almost fit, but it won't fit. So it won't pull through here, and you're going to constantly be having to fumble with it. You can just take this thing off, and neither side will pull through. You know, you could just take this thing off, pull it, throw it on the wall, whatever, and rock and roll. So I am excited to get it and put some sawdust on it and, and see what it'll do. Um, if uh, I figure anything else out about it, Maybe I'll make another video, y'all. Let me know if you have any questions. Hit me up in the comments. Tell me what I uh, don't know about this or what I'm missing. And, uh, yeah. That beautiful bean footage. How you doing that day? What do you think? You think it's pretty good? See if you can tear it. Give it a rough up. Get, get it good. Crutch. I won't let you do that very much. I don't think you can mess this up. No, but what do you think? You think it's pretty good? You think it's pretty good? Say so, yeah. It's Lady Day approved. Lady Day, shake on it. Sit. Shake. Sit. Shake. Shake. Good girl. Shake. Sit. Lay down. Good girl. Stay. Hey, thanks for tuning in. My name's Jacob. Someone call me Memphis J. It's Black and Tan Media. If you liked this video, consider subscribing, hit a like, give me a comment. All that stuff helps these uh, uh, logarithms. So, on that note, Lady Day, you okay? You ready to go? Alright, we're going to get out of here. Thanks for checking in. We'll catch you next time. Peace. Come here. Step up. Roll the credits. Stay. Hello. Helium. Nope. Sit. 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 Hit. Sit. Sit. Lay down. Lay down. Stay. Hello. Help. Helium. Over here. Nope, 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 that ain't the answer.
Sit down. Sit down. Sit. Stay. Help! Helium! Over here! Heal. Good girl. Good girl. Hey. What are you still doing here? Get, get out of here. You can't be here. <laughs>